Hi guys, this is Luciana from Eye for Beauty and today I want to talk about a skincare brand that I have been loving. It's called Pyongyang Yo. And I have four of the Pyongyang Yo brands or products. I have four of the Pyongyang Yo products that I have been trying out. Um, I have the Essence Toner, the Moisture Serum, the Moisture Cream, and the Moisture Ampule. But before we get to talking about those products, let's talk about the brand itself and, and the main ingredients. Pyongyang Yo is created by a traditional Korean medicine clinic that is based in Korea. The clinic is called the Pyongyang Yo Oriental Medicine Clinic. The brand is known for its products that contain the fewest number of ingredients. Most skincare products have ingredients like emulsifiers, emollients, solvents. Um, those are basically ingredients that help create the texture or the scent of the products. Well, Pyongyang Yo decided to eliminate those filler ingredients. So the ingredients that are inside the these Pyongyang Yo products are ingredients that are actually working on your skin for your skin. Pyongyang Yo products also do not contain water because apparently even though water is good, very good for your body, it's not that good to apply water on your skin because water uh, evaporates very easily and um, so when you apply water on your skin and when it evaporates from your skin, it takes some moisture out of your skin and so drying out your skin. And so, yeah, so Pyongyang Yo product doesn't contain water. Pyongyang Yo is also known to be cruelty free, so they don't test on animals. First of all, before I go into the products, I just want to say that I have combination to oily skin, which basically means that um, my cheeks are normal. It could get a little oily. My forehead is definitely oily. It's the, it's the most oily part of my face. Um, and then my nose, tends to be on the dry side it could be it could, it could get very dry that it's like flaky and then i guess my chin is normal so i have combination to oily skin when i test out um products for my skin type again my forehead is usually my indicator um if the product controls my sebum Usually the next morning, my forehead won't be oily, but at the same time, it will still feel hydrated, like it doesn't feel dry. But if a product is too heavy for me, then the next morning when I wake up, there's like oil all over my forehead, um, or I feel like there's a slight film all over my face. Let's talk about the Pyongyang Yul Essence Toner first. So over 91% of the essence donor is made up of this ingredient called the astragalus membranaceous root extract, which is also known as the milk vetch root extract or huang chi. This is a plant that is in the beans family. And this ingredient is usually used in traditional um, Chinese medicines because it helps treat diabetes naturally. It also boosts the immune system and it helps prevent or slows down um, the growth of tumors. It's also antiviral, antibacterial, anti-cancerous, um, and anti-inflammatory. Now for the skin, what this ingredient does is that it produces more hyal hyaluronic acid. Hyaluronic acids are molecules that are already produced by your skin naturally. Hyaluronic acid increases the production of collagen and higher collagen helps slow down the aging process even more. So that is one of the benefits of the Pyongyang Yo products. Astragalus membranaceous root extract also has antibacterial properties. So that means that it, it helps heal wounds faster and that means that it helps uh, clear your acne faster, supposedly. The Pyongyang Yo Essence Toner is both an essence and a toner. Um, if you wanna hear about what essences and toners do or where it falls in the skincare routine steps, I will suggest a video up here. Um, but basically, yes, this is both an essence and a toner. And most toners and essences are very watery, very liquid, very runny. This one actually has more of a gel-like slippery consistency. Put too much. Okay, so it's still very runny and very um it's still very runny and liquid but 
if you feel it, it is like slippery. And but if you you know put it on your skin, it does smell like water. And then so you do that, and then you basically just tap it. You can use um, a cotton pad for this, or you can just you know put some on your hand. If I feel like using it as a toner, I put it on a on a cotton pad and then swipe it across my face and then I do it again just just the product on my hand rub my hands together to warm it up and then pat it onto my skin so as you can see it doesn't have any greasy residue and it's very hydrating my skin drinks this up my skin absorbs it so easily so fast oh and there's also no sticky residue i don't like any stickiness in my products and this one has none and it doesn't smell it doesn't smell like anything it literally has no scent so those of you who are sensitive to scents you don't have to worry about that with the pyongyang essence toner actually it, none of the Pyongyang Yu products have scents. So that's the essence toner. Um, like I said, it's very hydrating. I have combination to oily skin, so I have to be careful with, you know, hydrating skincare products that I use because I don't want it to um, make my skin even more oily and more greasy. But at the same time, I want to control this my sebum and i think this toner does very well in controlling my sebum i think this toner also works for other skin types uh, my fiance uses the same this toner too and he has he has dry and sensitive skin and he loves it this is hydrating for his dry skin too so i think this toner really does work for all skin types next pyongyang new product that i want to talk about is the moisture serum the moisture serum the moisture ampule and the moisture cream they all have the same main ingredient which is coptis japonica root extract coptis japonica root extract is known for balancing the water and the oil in the skin so this is the moisture serum it comes in a dropper um, it's the bottle is the same as the essence toner it's high quality plastic it's definitely not glass and the moisture serum as well as the moisture ampule comes with a dropper now this is probably the only thing that i don't like with the pingong packaging the dropper okay first of all when i got the moisture ampule and the moisture serum with both droppers i had to put to put a like a stick inside like you know in the middle like in the hole in the middle because it was i felt like the products weren't wasn't coming out at all and so i had to like stick it um, to open the hole after like using it once this product flows pretty well but then like after all of the product comes out of the dropper you still see this white see the white inside the dropper you would think that there's more products inside this dropper but there isn't I'm squeezing and squeezing and squeezing and not nothing else comes out and so i think this white some of the products like get stuck inside the like on the inside walls of the of the dropper i really don't like the droppers in the pyongyang packaging so let me show you the consistency the consistency of the moisture serum itself is milky it's, it is runny and milky and absorbs pretty fast on my face not so much on my hand here but but I really like it. It doesn't feel heavy at all. Um, the consistency is a little bit heavier than most serum. I feel like most serum is just like liquid, like water, like very, very runny. This one is not as runny. So it's a little bit thicker consistency than most serum, but it really doesn't feel thick on the skin at all. It feels very light. There's no greasy residue, um, nothing. And just like your skin just feels hydrated at after you put this on your skin and like tap it in yeah i really like this moisture serum and it doesn't leave a sticky residue it doesn't leave a greasy residue um it also doesn't have a scent like other pyongyang products the only thing i don't like about it again is the dropper but now the moisture cream looks like this again it's the same bottle um same like paper but this one you have to dip your finger in it has that topper
and the inside is um it is a cream consistency it's a pretty thick cream consistency or at least that's what it looks like so this is what a consistency looks like it looks just like a cream and when you put it on the on when you know when you mix it on your skin it does thin out a little bit honestly i really wanted to like this cream maybe my skin is a little too oily for this cream because when i put it on my skin it just feel a little heavy i feel like there's a slight film on my face i'm going to try it on my fiance who has dry skin and see how he likes it Does anyone who has oily skin out there who have used this Pyongyang moisture cream, do you guys like it or do you guys think that it's a little bit on the heavy side too for us with oily skin? Last but not least, let's talk about the Pyongyang moisture ampule. I know this has an ampule and an ampule is usually the same thing as a serum and you would use it in the same step as the serum step. But this ampule is not your typical ampule it's more like a sleeping mask so you use this at the end of your skincare routine um, to seal everything in the consistency is also very unique which is another reason that i wouldn't use it before at the end of your skincare routine okay, and again this comes in a dropper and i don't like the dropper there you go but yeah this this dropper doesn't seem as bad as the moisture serum dropper, but that's because the product itself is clear. So you can't see if any of the product is stuck inside the, on the inside wall of the dropper. So as you can see, the consistency is slimy, almost like a snail product, but it's, there's no snail secretion in it. And it's clear and you can see it's not as runny as like the serum or anything like that um, and to be honest there is a tackiness to it see it's a little bit you can see that it's kind of sticky when you're when you're using this you're not supposed to spread the product it just doesn't work that way you're supposed to tap it into your skin until it's absorbed by your skin because you will see that if you like try to spread it, it's not that spreadable. Um, I don't think my skin absorbs this as well as um, it absorbs the essence toner and the moisture serum. This one does have a sticky residue, which is something that I don't like. So I wouldn't put makeup on top of this. So I use this in my night care routine. And again, this works more like a sleeping mask. So it seals all your previous skincare product. It seals in your moisturizer. It's seals in your serum and you know anything else that you have on your face um overall i really like the brand i really like the products incorporating these two in my skincare routine has definitely helped control the sebum on my face and i do feel like my skin doesn't get as oily as it usually does um it feels a lot more balanced and i think that that is contributed by incorporating these two in my skincare routine it does work at least for me um, i would love to hear how the dry skin people uh, or the normal skin people feel about the pyongyang product let's see and also the pyongyang essence toner helps you skip a step instead of using two products two different products like one for toner and one for essence you can just use one. If you go to olali.com, they have a quick guide that will show you which Pyongyang products are best suited for your skin type. So that is it for my review today. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Feel free to follow me on Instagram and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!